from the roof at the Case Center in Boston. It's Boston University basketball tonight. It's the Terriers against the Northeastern Huskies. It's a player that can play multiple positions for Bill Cohen. He got blocked underneath that time and maybe two blocks on that possession for BU. And underneath, Anthony Morales makes it a 10-point BU lead. Well, I've been BU off to the quick start here in the season opener. Brewster, oh, nice feed to Chemezi, and one for Malcolm Chemezi. Uh, the, the passing has been superb. Over on the dribble, McClintock, beautiful dish to Troutman. Well, uh, Walter White went for it. He thought McClintock was going for the layup. And the Terriers give it right back. McClintock finds Telforth the trailer. Well, uh, McClintock has given it up twice. He's done a great job of making Walter White commit. They have had 12 more shots from the floor than Northeastern has. That's a great pivot by the big man Landrum. How about the footwork there that's for the 18 year old? Well, that's what you call it. Might play as many as 10 guys in the first half. He's done it one better. He's played 11. And there is number five from number five. Walter White has five threes in the first half. And again, the clock is not operating right now. And a block inside as Woods tried to penetrate. Great hook pass to White for the dunk, and BU is up by five again as the roof explodes. It's almost. Kalen Jones gets rid of it. The Terriers move it for Tynan. His three and one. The foul called on Masai Troutman. That's a big shot for the first points of the season for Fletcher Tynan. Well, Morales tries the baseline, gets shut off. He'll go into a post move and score inside. Uh, he has mismatched. Troutman, now McClintock, he'll take it over Brewster and hit. Big three for McClintock and that ties the game uh, at that, 53. That's turn. who will do it for the Terriers? Oh, they feed Walter White on the post. That was not an easy pass by Miles Brewster. Woods, the kick out for Walter White. Northeastern is that's back, but White spins around. No whistle called on McClintock, but White is able to keep his composure and hit. And to go here in this one. You wonder if this is an important possession here, Brian, for Northeastern. And they go into Darty. The block by Morales. What a play by Anthony Morales. At the rim. Whether they get the foul call or not, get something going to the basket. Put pressure on this Northeastern team. Walter White took a look at a three. Shot clock running out. Walter has to take it. And he makes it with two seconds on the clock. That was a deep two for Walter. Well, when it and since this rivalry came back to be a season opener a number of years ago, this is the first time that BU will win here at home. They had been 0-4 against Northeastern in season openers prior to tonight. And not to mention, we mentioned 14 out of the last 15 contests between these two teams were eight points or less. Here it is, a nine point game. And Doug, what, what, what did you say was coming down to the final possession? Doug's 0 for 1 this season. Walter, you hit a career high of 27 points in tonight's game. How does it feel to contribute this achievement to your team's win tonight? It feels really good. I felt like we put a lot of work in the offseason, and we just came ready to play. I just did everything I could to help our team win, and I feel like we got a lot of contributions from everybody on the team. Everybody stepped up, we played hard, we defended well, and we executed the game plan. We like to put an emphasis on the first game of the season. How did you think your team was prepared for tonight's game after seeing them practice for several weeks in the preseason? Every day is a different day. Every day is a different day when it comes to practice, but these guys have been pretty consistent. You know, they get after each other pretty good. I felt pretty good going into the game. I thought we practiced pretty hard the last few days. And guys pretty much, we got some older guys, so they know what it takes to get ready for a game. Uh, and especially a, a cross time, a cross town rival like Northeastern, so very familiar with each other. Uh, so I thought our guys pretty much did a good job this week getting ready for this. And speaking of Northeastern having that young team, six freshmen, five of which played tonight. How challenging was it for you not to have film to watch them going into this game? Well, you knew some of the reputations of some of these guys uh, as far as coming out of high school and AAU. Uh, but still a different thing when you get into a college game and not knowing what to expect. And those guys are really talented, so they're going to be good for a long time. Thanks, Coach.